Time to dip. Sup, brothers and she's hey, 2025 right there. So, a little flashback. Uh, okay, first of all, guys, I am not. Uh, I'm not going to be doing the highways anymore. Uh, mainly because that was a pain he has to do, and I ended up killing the chick. So that ended up being a waste of time. Because this game doesn't auto save every like 10 minutes or something or every time you do something. Which is just amazing. Because why would it do that, right? So we're just going to get rid of all this and I uh, will keep that. Just like a little, who cares. And you know, I uh, I I guess cancel actually. I don't I mean I don't wanna lose it. Actually, you know what? Private storage. That's where we wanna put it. That way holy shit, I forgot about how shit I have here. But this way I never lose it. But anyways, so instead of completing the highways Um we're just going to Take a long range bike. Actually, oh, that's a truck. I'm gonna take a. Oh, wait, okay, well, let's retrieve this first of all. Well, what we're gonna do, take a long range bike, because bikes are faster than the truck. And my vehicle is dismantled. I think. Oh, that's my truck right there. All right, we're just gonna store this. So I'm not I'm not building that highway anymore. Uh, what it is right now is what it's gonna be probably for the rest of the game because uh, it pissed me off too much that I did all of that work for the game not to save and then me to lose it. So at this point, the game kind of made me that mad that I'm just going to. Literally all I'm aiming to do now is just beat the game, uh, mainly because I'm pissed off. And I don't know what happens after you beat the game, I don't know if you can uh, continue playing or not. So if you can continue playing then maybe one day if I come back to this game then I'll make videos on that. But for now, this is what we're going to do, because this is pissed me off too much. So, we're gonna do this fast. I'm not gonna waste any time. Because I know you guys. <laughs> Last video was literally just a waste of time, basically. But it is nice to see the entire highway be built. And I basically rid, ridden on the entire highway in that video. So it was nice for that. At least I can have the satisfaction of having done that before, before not being able to ever do it again. So, yeah. Anyways, we're gonna head over to the the mountain place now. So, we're really not making a single stop on the way there. Just going straight there. So, power grid is a very interesting thing in this game, so I don't exactly understand how it works. Because power grid is over there, but it's not over here. Is this a power grid? Maybe this is a power grid. What would be the power grid? This? Oh, power grid is in the middle. I guess maybe if I read or read the fucking thing, it says energy zone. It doesn't matter because that's not something ever going to be on that for the rest of the trip. 
Alright, so... I'm not going to be getting as much likes anymore because of the fact that I lost a lot of the highway and all this highway that I built last video is no longer here, so... Yeah. This is fucking awesome. I literally can't see though. This is a wind powered thing, so that I guess makes sense to why it charges slower in other areas. See, I didn't know this bitch was so damn fragile. If she just didn't die last video, if she didn't die, this would have been all perfect. And literally, the only thing left is no matter what happened, I always dropped her. Like, literally, I. this is one reason I really dislike this game. Is it automatically wants to put everything on, on your back instead of putting it in available slots? That's what it should do. Alright, let's see, because I can't really carry anything on my back because I have this bitch on my back, right? So instead of putting it, say, on my arms or something, it just kicks her off, and that's literally the, that's why she died. So they kept doing that. Which is so bullshit if you ask me. And since we're on a bike, we're probably gonna get hit a couple times. And she's also probably gonna get hit, so this is probably just gonna run for her. So yeah, I probably should have uh, went somewhere to save the game. That also can be my problem then, within my fault. It's just, at the end of the day, I think the main thing is that this game should definitely be saving a lot more. That's, I think, the main thing that you should be taking away. That it should save way more than stuff. Because it expects us to deliver this bitch through, so we have to go through BT areas. And you can't carry guns on you. But you literally can't. Because of this fucking bitch. Like literally, I have to deliver her. Like why can't she fly or something, you know what I mean? Like this is so stupid. What the is that over here? Okay, glad the brakes work on this thing. You know what I was doing before I started the video? Making this video? I mean, this girl I've been talking for one day. And she reveals to me now. And and she she talked to me the entire night. No, she, she, we stayed up together. And she reveals this. She reveals this. The next day. Saying. Yeah, I got. Or she, she, so she went and unblocked a bunch of people on Snapchat. The guys that apparently sent her dick pics. And. Um, 
basically she said after that, oh my boyfriend is not happy about this. I haven't read her message yet after that. Cause I just sent I just I think I just sent oh who's that? Or something like that. I'm not really concerned for this girl. I am concerned actually. She's a bit of a hoe. Uh, I don't know if she knew that. I don't know if her boyfriend knows that. I mean, she, he, I mean, I bet his boyfriend would probably get him. Because me and this chick talked for quite a while, and she did not tell me she had a boyfriend. I mean, granted, she did a day later, but sometimes I can be a little too late. This is why you never trust girls. Never. No, you just never do. There's another girl I've been talking to. You know, you know what? She, I, she's being all dickless because I won't show my, or not because not I won't show my face. Because I won't tell her my last name. Yeah. Because apparently that's the end of the world if she knows. But she doesn't know. So she's gonna absolutely murder my ass until she figures it out. Like, it's not a big deal. I didn't send her a okay. I didn't send her a dick pic or anything. I thought about it, and I just didn't know. Honestly, I'm not that dick pic kind of guy. You know what I mean? Who asked that? Do you remember your own birth? Okay, obviously. Who, who, can you, can someone actually sit here? And tell me that they remember their birth. Hmm? If the likes go down, I wouldn't be surprised. You know, I actually underestimated the amount of battery this thing has. Like how long the battery lasts? How did we just do that? Someone explain that to me. Yo. Okay. Yeah, that bitch. Bruh. Man, that bike is fucking dope, actually. I literally got here with like two charges, maybe three. It's awesome. There we go. Took us right into a cutscene, too. That's quite impressive, actually. She dead? I know we had a rough journey, but. Um, <laughs> Come on, Adol. Oh. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I love you so much. I love you so much. You should have kept you in the car. Try to save her. You, couldn't, you don't have to say anymore. Look, you need to fix hands, Cupid. I couldn't save her child, but you can save her world. Only you. I love you. Can you hear me? Forever. Always. Thank you, Uncle. Okay? Just like you make me.
I almost killed her again. Can you believe that? Holy shit, how many songs? So I've not been paying attention if she did. sure someone's tweaked it. Either that or my memory is going to pieces. Someone rewrote your code? Rewrote might be overstating it. Let's just say it wasn't the latest version I released. And yet, because of you would smash the fuck out of this girl this right here. I'm not gonna lie. Like, could be holy. I mean, honestly, both of them. They're both very smashable. Smash... Okay, the thing is... They're twins, right? Because they were born... Because she could feel her... I'm pretty sure they're twins. Which means... That I could fuck twins. If these two and Norman were in bed. I mean, it wouldn't be me, but Norman. Norman would have twins. Would get twins. I don't fucking know how to say. That would be so sick. Dude, Norman. Oh, Norman, you're missing out on an opportunity here, man. Cause you're like the savior right now, right? So it'd be so dope. This guy just got the laid with twins, you know what I'm saying? That'd be sick. So close to the coast. Please don't tell me we have to try and get other sh fucking connections because that would suck. Sis? If I can hear you. I can smell my dick right now. Don't ask me how. I need to clean. <laughs> I need to clean. Tomorrow, shower, I'm gonna clean this bitch. I was just crying. Why? Ew, her eyes are two different colors. Wait, do do did the, that girl get into that girl? It was good, man. I don't want to listen to this guy that. talks for work will help ensure that the Kyra network remains online. Together we might just make it all the way west. Now then, Zan, there's something else you ought to know. Mm -hmm. We've been studying the data from when you claim you encountered those soldiers. We had audio which doesn't paint a complete picture on its own, but the languages, the names, and terms we picked out. The munitions we could identify. Everything seems to indicate that you were on a battlefield over a hundred years ago. World War One. 
Yeah, to World be War One. Yeah. It wasn't a dream. It wasn't a hallucination. Maybe you were spirited away to another dimension or something. Given the time discrepancies, maybe you were sent to a beach. You can't say anything for certain. That said, I. Oh my God! Shut the fuck up. So, one of the other girls that I've been texting managed to change her hair. Uh, actually, no, no, this is the same girl that asked for my last name. She changed her haircut. Should I tell her nice hair? That's such a bad idea. Well, we're just going to leave it. Yeah, maybe I will. No, maybe I will. Maybe I will. What's the worst that can happen? Nothing. All right. I'm not really up to... We can't leave, okay. And we can't teleport, well. I guess we gotta take a shower then. Check on this motherfucker. Oh. What the hell? Ooh, looking for this? Surprise! Fragile warped me here. I finally got to visit the beach. Well, her beach. Don't worry. I didn't come all this way for the sightseeing. Your beloved BB has a serious issue. What's wrong with your forehead? Oh god. You may recall me explaining no, that these incubators connect BBs via the chiral network to their still mothers back at HQ. Bridge babies are quite literally bridges between this world and the other side. Their place is not here with us, nor with the BTs over there. They belong precisely in between, with no greater affinity for one world or the other. But BB-28 here has been leaning further and further towards the world of the living. Towards you, Sam. That's because we're partners. Hmm. Partners? Sam, a BB's a tool, not a human being. Bridge, yes. Baby, no. So tell me what the problem is. This tool, this weapon, is transforming into a living being. It's gaining weight. Its brain activity is increasing. It's accumulating memories. BB-28 is becoming self-aware, becoming an actual child. Doesn't sound like a problem to me. It's hardware, Sam. Manufactured for a purpose. A purpose it cannot fulfill outside the pod. There is a 70% risk of catastrophic failure simply in removing it. Which hardly matters because at this point, it'll cease functioning within a couple of days. Cease functioning? That's right. Not even the pod will be enough. It'll be bricked. What do we do? We reset it. You'll have to leave it with me, of course. I'll cut the cord that links the two of you and then perform an operation that reconnects it to the other side. Think of it as a little tug to correct its alignment, to put it back where it belongs, right between the world of the living and the dead. But like I said, you'll have to be without it for a while. You're sure this will work? <laughs> of course. One catch, though. The surgery may erase its memories. Erase? You will forget me? Relax. The BB will still function as intended. You just have to trust me. Come on. Uh, I'm telling you, it's like a game. Just select me, try, and start again! Uh. Oh! And this is why I hate these things. Ugh. Ugh. Sam. I 
was already filthy from my trip through the beach. But now your BB has added insult to injury. Try and take a shower, I guess. <laughs> what the fuck? some digging into the first BP experiments. Officially, they were suspended by the government following a void out which claimed the life of the then acting president. Documents were shredded. BB technology banned, yes? But obviously, the experiments continued in secret on the direct orders of President Strand. Bridget? Central to solving the mystery of the Death Stranding. Oh, she had big plans for them. They weren't designed just to be BT detectors. She wanted to incorporate them into the cargo network to facilitate travel to the beach. But none of her plans ever came to fruition. And now BB Tech has fallen into terrorist hands. What's Die Hardman's part in this? I'm afraid to find out. I don't know how long he was working for Strand. I don't even know his real name or his face. I thought you might, since you two go further back. He was already wearing a mask when I met him. Something about burning his face. Right. Sorry. Any data we have from back then is classified at the highest level. As far as I know, the director is the only one with clearance. But the chiral network presents a new opportunity. By compiling fragmented data in the public domain from all across the country, I might be able to piece together a little more of the puzzle. Be careful, Sam. They're watching. Well, Sam, you're a good sport. I'll give you that. Still, it's a fine way to get out of doing the laundry. Just fix BB, all right? Oh, no. You'll be doing the fixing. I'd never manage without your help. <laughs> Check the delivery terminal upstairs for the details. When you're ready, of course. Hmm. Kill that we just see Norman smiling. <laughs> Alright. How did that get on our hand, dude? We never picked it up. Alright, well, let's leave, because I'm not... I'm, like I said, man, I'm literally... I'm just planning on beating the game and then never playing it again. At least for a while anyways, because this game has really pissed me off. A lot. So. Yeah. Uh -oh. 
Uh, anyways, let's get this somewhere else if I can. Okay, this is what I mean. There's so much fucking dot. Like, these guys don't shut the fuck up. Turns out I literally have to. Shouldn't there really be a bike up here? I literally have to fucking. Oh, yeah, here, I'll show you. I have to connect this entire region that, it, like, I'm in. So. It's kind of like what we did before, but it sucks in the longest time. This is how you get to the doctor. That's what I'm assuming. Let's open to right now. You know. Yeah, I changed my mind. I think I know how to get. I don't know why there's a bridge here. I don't know. I, I thought the bridge would mean like you cross the bridge. I want to help you. Oh. 
Okay, so basically what we have to do, go back here. That bridge is the bridge we're looking for. Okay, I see where we gotta go. to do this one with the vehicle. Alright, so that's what I'm going to do now. Okay, let's just leave the bike here and let's go. Oh, shit. Why didn't no one build a bridge here? Do I have a PCC? Of course not. Okay. Well. Come on. 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 You're almost there. You're almost there. Come on. There we go. Wait. Can we climb back up? Oh shit. I didn't think that through. Um. Well, this motherfucker better join, because uh, this place is confusing to navigate through, so. Just make it so I don't have to come back here, please. Really? Make BB feel better by connecting up nearby facilities to keep it. Wow. That's not even smooth. That's stupid. Oh my god. Are they connecting? Okay, sick. I probably have to connect all that shit. Thanks. I'll show you what I mean. The fuck is that? Just connect like this, like a whole area. How the hell do we even get to that fucking guy? Please access delivery terminal. Oh my lord! Something tells me we better run to him. Buddy. I was gripping. I was gripping. Hope you guys know that.
Alright, well. This is probably how you get to this motherfucker. Which, if you ask me, it's stupid. But I, you know, actually. I do kind of like it, though. Dude, dude, I didn't. I don't know how that happened. I didn't do anything. Come on, just come on. Oh, yeah. Come on. Alright. Alright, I'm gonna leave this one here. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.